Hmm. Okay, we'll do. Um. Oh, come on, when you get serious. Give me a break, okay? I told you, these things take time. Gorge, is it just me? Or is this turning into a routine? Huh? Uh... What? It's coming from you, Sora. Huh? Oh. Uh... What's this? Not me. Magic stop. But I don't know how. Maybe this. Huh? Dale? Hey, Chipper! I finally got him! Hurry up, Chip! Well, it's about time! Chip? You gotta answer the phone, Sora! Or we can't give you updates! We got lots and lots of important stuff we want to tell you! That's why we asked Master Yen Sid to make sure you got this gummy phone we made ya! So we'd be able to stay in touch with you at all times! And it takes pictures. Oh, you finally finished it. Say, with this gummy phone, we can talk to each other across worlds. In fact, I might even try writing my journal on it. Wow. Sounds like it's pretty handy, guys. So, what's so important? This. Back when you and Riku quested through the sleeping worlds, Riku recovered some secret research data that Ansem the Wise hid inside you. Ansem's code! So we've only deciphered some of it. Huh? Oh. I guess we haven't spoken since the castle. I'm Ienzo. Alias is here too. Alias. Whatever's between you and Roxas, it's in the past. <sighs> Zora. The reason we're here is because you and your friends defeated our nobodies, thereby recompleting us. We cast off our hearts by choice, make no mistake. But we didn't know that Xemnas, or rather, Xehanort, was deceiving us. Huh? Xemnas? Oh, he's with them! Not anymore. Xemnas and Xehanort have no hold over us now. We're just students of the heart. Exactly the same as we were before all of this began. Yeah, right. Hmm. But you know, now that I think about it, Axel's on our side now. Uh... We have friends we want to bring back to this world just the same as you. To do that, we have to work together. In that spirit, Sora, we found some intriguing data in the bit of code we deciphered. Is it about me? Yes. In order to piece your memories back together, our teacher Ansem the Wise took a close look at your heart. And what he found is that your heart doesn't belong just to you. It doesn't? Gorge, you don't seem surprised. Yeah. Honestly, I suspected as much. There's another heart inside mine. I think it's Roxas's. Just like Namine is still inside Kyrie's. Interesting. Well, no one knows your heart better than you. To be honest, we still have a plethora of questions on our side. But the idea has merit. It's incredible enough that you and your nobody are able to coexist. If you share a heart, no wonder someone as remarkable as you caught Ansem the Wise's eye. We'll keep investigating based on your hypothesis. I'll be in touch. Okie dokie, we'll give you fellows a ring if there's anything else. Remember, me and Chip, the guys at Radiant Garden, and King Mickey and everybody are never far away. And Jiminy, would you do us a favor? Teach Sora how to use the gummy phone? Leave it to me. Ah. 
I have to find Roxas and save him. The others are following Aqua's heart. So I'll follow Roxas's heart. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Trust the guidance that your heart gives you, Sora. That's what Master Yen Sid said. <laughs> oh, that's easy. Gorge, we forgot to fill Master Yen Sid in on what happened. Should we go back? Hmm. You mean about Maleficent and Zigbar? No. The others have already got enough on their plates as it is. Why go stressing them out? The three of us know how to handle a couple of old adversaries, right? Yeah, I guess. But doesn't that thing Pete said bother you? The black box? Come on, we're talking about Pete. That means it's probably no big deal. Oh, I don't know. Oh, cool! The trams are still here! So, uh, that one. Feels like it. Maybe you're feeling what Roxas feels because he misses home. Mm-hmm. Actually, I ran into Roxas in the Sleeping Worlds. It was like seeing into his heart for the first time. And he was from the Dana Stamp, too. Uh-huh. 
it was a test to see if your data version was ready to face the hurt that you carry inside. Was I ready? I do know hurt. When I lost Riku and Kairi, and later when I lost the Keyblade, and you guys had to go on without me like that? Having no one to turn to was the worst kind of hurt, but that just shows how much you mean to me. Carrying around a little hurt can't be all that bad. Hurting is part of caring. Of course, any Sora is still Sora. So wait, if Roxas feels something, then we're in the right place. Roxas, I'm gonna find you. Huh? What is that? Nobody! <gasps> What was that voice? I know I heard it. I didn't hear it. You sure it wasn't the wind? Or something else? I'm pretty sure. Where'd they come huh? from? Get the ice cream later. Huh? <laughs> what? Hold up. See? Voices. New ones? <laughs> What? Hainer? Pence! Olette! <laughs> what? what is that? <laughs> hey! Sora! Hello, goodbye! Uh, oh. <laughs> Go! We got this! Yeah. 
Nice fighting. Thanks, Sora. Hayner, Pence, Olette, it's been ages. What? It hasn't been that long. Yes, hey. Donald, Goofy, how are ya? We're good. Howdy there, Olette. So does this mean that weird stuff's going down again? You kidding, uh. Pence? When have we ever seen a tornado of shadowy blobs before? It's not weird. This is underprecedented. Hmm, I guess it is. The creatures from the last time were bright white. These things must be new. Man, I can't wait to get to sleuthing. We are already done with the school project, silly. Whatever's going on, you wouldn't be here unless you had a good reason. Which is? Well, actually, we're looking for Roxas. Roxas? That's funny. I don't know any Roxas, mm. but the name sounds familiar. Maybe we bumped into him somewhere. Uh, that's one way to put it. Actually, he might have been friends with another version of you. Hmm? This photograph. Yeah, we've got the same one. Oh, yeah, the other Twilight Town. It's like one of those Spot the Differences puzzles, except really easy. I guess in that town, we're friends with this Roxas person. Sora, let us help you track Roxas down. <laughs> really? Sure, he seems like a pretty cool guy. <laughs> yeah, he is. Great, then let's all go ask around town. If alternate us knew Roxas, then maybe alternate other folks did too. Mm -hmm. Sora, you three should go to the place in the photo. It's the old mansion. The three of us will cover places in town. Thanks. Oh yeah, I got this phone thingy that takes pictures. <laughs> Wanna snap a photo while we're all here? Sure, that's a great idea. <laughs> yeah. Hmm? Wait, who's taking it? Oh. Hmm. Mm. Uh, why do I have to do it? Hey, tough luck. You drew the short straw. It's okay. Oh, I'm sitting out of the photo with you, Donald. Can you take the photograph? Huh. 
Everybody smile! <laughs> yep. Wow! That came out great! Oh, a lucky emblem! Lucky emblem? Oh yeah, they are huge right now. Supposedly, these things are hidden all over town. And if you get a picture of them, they'll bring you good luck. Cool! <laughs> Wait, look guys, is that... <laughs> You're right! I see it too! <laughs> I knew it! Good luck, because they're not all this easy to find. Okay, we better start asking around. You start by checking out the old mansion. We'll catch up. Got it! know those ears anywhere. Yeah. Okie dokie, ready to check out the old Thanks. mansion? I think that's a lucky emblem.
Oh. Heartless! What do you think they're up to? Uh -huh. Hmm. Look! On that branch! The Heartless have him surrounded! Oh no! What's up? Yeah! Well, take care. Want you to pick up the fruit for him. Mm, okay, that's fine, but I can do it by myself. I just need to collect the fruit. Right then. So, what are you going to do with all this anyway? Careful going home. See you around. Next stop, the mansion. Come on. Here we go. That little feller sure seems happy. Yeah. <laughs> 
I see it. That building up ahead. What do you think, guys? This place is even creepier than I remember. Well, they do say that this mansion is haunted. <sighs> hey there. <gasps> <gasps> Thanks for the heart attack. Oh, what? Did I scare you? So how did it go? Did you get any leads? <laughs> nope. Afraid not. The asking around thing was a total bust. Yep. This old mansion is our last hope. You guys ready? Another Twilight Town awaits. Yeah. Here we go. Eh, the password was, uh, sea salt ice cream, right? Okay, I'm in. Let's get that transporter working. Uh, uh. Oh man, the transporter's been protected. Protected from what? I guess from us? We can't use it to get to the other Twilight Town. Why not? It worked before. We sent Sora there. Well, that was then. And this is now. And there's no other way? None that I know. Great. Well, huh? Hello, Sora. You wouldn't happen to be in front of a computer. Huh? Well, yeah. But how do you know that? I was tinkering with Ansem's computer. You know, to decrypt the code that was left in it. And I noticed that someone had logged in from another terminal. I figured it might be you. Uh, oh, yeah, the log terminal. You don't know what you said. Oh, oh, and what? You do? <laughs> I know. Oh, I haven't got a clue. <laughs> yep. Then, uh... Who was it that logged in? Oh, hi there. This is Pence. I'm the one who logged into the computer. Good. As long as it's a user that we know we can trust. Yup. But I'm kind of stuck here. Hmm. One of the programs is protected, so... I can't uh... run it. Which program? Uh, the transporter to the other Twilight Town! Uh, uh... It's the only way to find Roxas. You gotta help us. Another Twilight Town? And a transporter? Okay. A virtual town inside the computer made of data. A datascape? Fellas! Mm-hmm. We've seen one. That's what we used once to investigate Jiminy's journal. Maybe I can do something. Pence, let's get a network set up. My address here is... Okay, 
Sharing is enabled. <gasps> huh? Were you able to fix it? Now that our two computers have been successfully networked together, I can take control of the terminal there and change the privileges. And Roxas? Yes. For the virtual world to be completely realized, Ansem the Wise would have included Roxas' full data in the construction. Meaning, somewhere on your machine there's a log of that data that... Uh... Basically, we can decipher Ansem's code more quickly, and we can analyze the virtual Twilight Town while we're at it. Okay, great. I can't computer, so do that. Glad you're following along. Don't worry, we'll handle it. Chip and Dale will be helping me out here on this end. I'll call you back as soon as we know anything more. Thanks. Oh, before I forget, a bit of troubling news. It's about one of the organization's former members. You knew him as Vexen. But to us, he was Ansem's apprentice, Evan. He was re-completed like the rest of us. But hadn't regained consciousness yet. Then, sometime after Lee left, Evan vanished. Alias and Dylan, the two you knew as Lexius and Zaldin, they went out looking for him, but he's just gone. And I'm starting to worry. Oh? You think he's on their side? I think it's a real possibility. He's a devious researcher. You should be careful. All right. Thanks. Oh no! We got work! I totally forgot! Really? But what about all this? Hey, both are important. We're gonna need some cash to go to the beach. Also, don't forget the pretzels. Gotta buy four now. Hmm? Uh... Oh, I get it. He's thinking ahead. <laughs> Later, Sora. Yeah, see ya, Hainer. Bye, Donald. Goofy. Goodbye! <laughs> oh, and since I'm manning the computer here, you guys are in charge of earning my share. No pretzel for pets. <laughs> hey! Hmm... <laughs> <laughs> So, what's next? Want to go back yeah. to town? Huh. Yeah. <laughs>